hey guys welcome back to my channel for today's video it's going to be a makeup video today's going to be a little different because as you see i already have my base on my face i'm going to try to start with my base because it's literally the same thing i already explained that and yeah i feel like it'll make things go a little faster so i'm going to try to do a dark look i've never really done it before so this is going to be interesting i'm pretty excited though like I don't really have a guide to this look it's just kind of like let's see how it goes hopefully it goes well so without further ado here is the video okay first thing i'm going to do is i'm going to prime my lids also i would like to acknowledge the fact that these eyebrows like what i don't know how i did them but they look pretty bomb so i'm happy I kind of wish I recorded that just so y'all could see how I did them because, I mean, it's the same way, but see, you know, sometimes you have days where they're better than others, and I guess today was that day. I'm going to prime my lids. I feel like I'm getting better at this whole um, showing my eye instead of the camera, I mean, showing my eye while looking at the mirror thing i don't know let me know if i'm getting better at that that was a little too much no primer is on now i'm going to um now i'm going to powder it i'm going to set it oh my god y'all know the drill same thing so now i'm gonna set my um primer now if you guys Um, now that I like set my primer, I am going to go in um, my theme. I'm trying to do like black, purple, and maybe like a blue. I don't know how well that's going to work out. This is the Morphe 456 brush and I'm going to use this black color what is that spooky in the james charles palette and i'm gonna go as light as possible because you know sometimes black is that overpowering color it is so i wanna i don't want to put too much because bro the cars are going crazy today like what so i don't want to put too much of that color because you can always add more you can never take off color so I mean, you can, unless you want to like ruin the whole thing. It takes a lot of work, but I'm not trying to do that. So I'm going to use this. Ooh. How has everyone been doing? Any new obsessions or anything? My new obsession is BTS, the Korean boy band, and they're really good. Even though I don't really understand some of the stuff they're saying, but it's okay. Just because you don't know what they're saying doesn't mean that they don't make good music. Okay, so this is what the black looks like. I know it's kind of like a mess, but don't worry, we're not done. But where is she? Escape. That's what I'm using. And I'm gonna put that in my crease. Hopefully this turns out good. Oh, this is the Morphe E62 brush in the James Charles collection. Okay. I'm gonna add more purple over here. So this is my purple. I feel like I'm getting better at this whole showing my eye while looking at the mirror. Maybe I'm not good at showing y'all what I'm doing. 
I think I'm gonna choose acapella. It's more of a like shimmery blue. So we're gonna see how that looks. Okay, so what I did was I took the blue and I put it on top of that purple crease to kind of make like a, a hint effect, kind of like a little shimmer. I'm gonna go back with the purple to blend it out a little bit. I actually have nothing on this brush right now but that, I don't know what I'm talking about, that's stupid. So now I'm just um, blending it up into that blue a little bit so that it blends well, connecting it. There. I wonder if this looks like mesh together on camera because when I look in the mirror it kind of looks like that. Like, I don't know. I don't think it looks like a mess. I'm going to do my under eyes. Hopefully it doesn't look bad on camera. Please don't let it look bad on camera. I think I'm gonna do the purple under my eyes because I don't know, because I want to. I'm dragging that down. Oh, should I wipe away the powder first? Nah, who cares? I'm dragging it down under my eye. Does this freak anyone out? Like getting it this close to my eye? New product alert. <laughs> New product alert. I usually use pen liners. Um, because I find it to be easier than the other liners. So remember when I said whenever I change something or I add something to my makeup routine, I will definitely make a big deal about it. Here it is. It's liquid liner but usually I like to use a pen. So I will be trying this out. Actually, I tried it out already and I was struggling with it. So I'm gonna be trying it again because like I said, I like to make a big deal when I change stuff in my makeup routine. And liner is something that I usually don't change because I like using pen liners, it's easier. And I just feel like I have more control with it. So this right here, we're gonna see how it works. Uh, this is the little thing. I don't know if it's focusing. Whatever. But this is the thing. Here we go. I feel like I'm getting better at this whole um, showing my eye while looking at, sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, okay, I'm struggling. This is so hard. How do people use this? Oh, I don't like it, but I'm trying guys. Oh, oh my God, do you see that? <gasps> no, no. Okay, it's not that close to like the eyeshadow where it messes it up. There's a <laughs> towel. Okay. <sighs> We're good guys. Back to this. I'm not giving up though. I don't know how that happened. My finger like slipped. Okay, let's try this again. I would say that it is darker than a pen liner, which is pretty cool. But at the same time, I just don't have control like I used to. Like this isn't good. I'm trying to fix it. It kind of burns too. I don't know why. I'm actually gonna take a pen liner as well 
And I'm just gonna make this wing a little better because I just do not have control on that. I'm sorry, I kind of gave up, but oh well. I'm gonna do this side off camera and then I'm gonna do lashes. So, okay, so I am back and I came to the conclusion that I had a cut on my eye and on my eyelid and that's why it was burning. So I definitely wanna recommend using this product when you have a, I don't recommend um, putting anything on your face if you have a wound or anything. But that's why I was burning. It wasn't the product. It was actually because I had a cut on my eye. And then I had a cut on my other eye too. So that eye was burning. So this is it. I don't like this liner because I messed it up. Sad. But I'm not going to take it off because I don't want to. That's too much work. I don't want to do that. So yeah. So I put my lashes. I have liner. And now I'm just going to wipe the bake away that I did. I feel like I'm getting better at this whole showing my eye while looking at the okay guys so this is the finished look i hope you guys enjoyed this video um follow me on all my social media instagram angel underscore halo 17 twitter this is angel 17 like i said someone took my name and i didn't like that so that is my name right there also thank you to the people that have subscribed to me and who has viewed my video um my tiktok video got like a hundred views now i am so happy about that so thank you so i'll see you guys next friday and bye